Hey good people, welcome back to another video. I'm Taquana, also known as Q, and today I have an Amazon haul. Some things that I picked up for the home. I have a few like odds and ends, but mainly it's home items. You may have seen these before, but if you're interested, keep watching. start with my nightstands I used to have two bedside tables but when I moved I wanted to try something different so I got these two nightstands from Amazon they were easy to put together I bought the gray alder and I needed something to put my water and set my um like my books and my things that I need at, at night any type of like medicine my allergy medicine or things that I keep at my nightstand I needed something to put it on I haven't dressed them up or styled them at all but these are definitely coming in handy I don't know if I want to do like pictures behind them or mirrors but these are good about they they're not super like oh look expensive they look expensive but when you touch them you know they're not that expensive but it's a quick fix and of, I'm not looking for my forever nightstand yet so it does the job Next, we have this static clean privacy film for the window. I have two, no, I don't. I have four windows on my front door, like very small, but if you're tall enough to look in, you can see right in. And I just wanted to put something up where you just can't see right in. This is pretty simple to put up. All you have to do is cut it and then it clings to the window. You spray it, you um, get a car or your ID or something that can smooth out the bubbles. And then you spray it with water and you it's good to go. But this was came in handy. A lot of my neighbors have the same thing. Next we have the Serta Thermogel Cooling Pressure Relieving Memory Foam Mattress Topper. So I've been looking for a mattress topper. I was looking at the Casa Luna one from Target, but I saw this one on Amazon and it had great reviews. I believe it was only 80 bucks. Don't quote me. But it's like sleeping on a cloud i don't know what i've been missing i really need to get a new mattress but i feel like even with my new mattress i would keep this mattress topper on because i bought the three inch thick one but what's happening is i think i have to get california king sheets because my sheets aren't fitting on my bed properly now because it's so thick but pause <laughs> If you're in the market for a new mattress topper or, you know, your mattress is kind of wearing out and it's time for something else or you, and you don't have, because I have a pillow top and you can't flip it over, I suggest you get this mattress topper. If you don't like the three inches too much, then try the two, two inch thick. And a lot of people were saying the other one has a stitch, but mine didn't have a stitch. I just had to take it out the plastic and allow it to rise and, you know, give thick paws <laughs> and then you put it on your bed. Next, we have these adhesive hooks. I'm, um, I've been buying everything that I can stick on the wall. And to take it off, all I'm going to do is use the blow dryer. It should like melt the adhesive and it should come right off. But these little bathroom hooks are clutch. Well, they're called the bathroom hooks. You can hook whatever you want. But I hooked um one on the side of my wall here because there isn't a coat closet down here so i take i put one of these hooks just so i can hang my coat or whatever jacket i'm wearing for the day and then i put these in my bathroom for my towel and my robe and i love these i need to order another pack it comes it with six in the pack next we have these clear plastic drawer organizers it comes with more than these different sizes, but this is the leftover and they are like this. If you all watch my other video, I have that vanity from Yitta Home and I wanted something to organize my things in it and not just like have it in there. And I bought some stuff from Walmart, but these look just like more aesthetically pleasing and just nicer. And I think it came... I think I got the 15 piece and it came in with different sizes. So if you're looking for drawer organizers, you already know Amazon got it. Okay, next we have a tension rod. So in my two, so I have two en suites upstairs and in the primary bedroom and the second bedroom, there's no door on the closet. Why didn't they make a door on the closet? I have no idea. It's, it, it doesn't register with me. It, it, uh, you, they gotta make it make sense. 
So me being the genius that I am, I bought a tension rod and kind of like the same thing, like a curtain rod. And I put the curtain on it. So the next item is the curtain. So I wanted like a floor to ceiling look to so it can look like it's a door, but you just move it, um, move the curtain to the side. And now I have a door. On to the next item, which is the curtain. It's very sturdy. I wanted something to look rich. It's actually a blackout curtain and they were kind of affordable. I think I got both curtains for 80 bucks. Um, but yeah, so they come in different colors. I bought the, I think it's 100 by 98. So that gave, I think I have eight foot ceilings and that gave me floor to ceiling, just seamless curtain. <laughs> Next, we have my Gorilla Glue double-sided tape. So again, I said I was only doing adhesive. Like, I don't want to put a lot of holes in the wall. And a lot of times, me being me, I put the holes in the wall and it's crooked and then I got to put more holes in the wall. So I do really like the adhesive and then I also like those command strips that have like just the Velcro ones. But I bought this because I wanted... No, oh, I ain't doing this last. Okay, next we have this black wet wipes container. I moved and you know I'm brand new and I wanted to add a little bit more razzle dazzle because I just had the plastic ones on the um, back of the toilet and I didn't want it on the back of the toilet in here, but you just put your wet wipes in. This has a silicone uh, liner so it doesn't, uh-oh. Kind of messed it up. This has a silicone liner so it doesn't get any moisture or like dryness inside. And um, yeah. So I bought this and then along to put this on, I bought the acrylic shelf. They are put up so I'm going to do a split screen for those. I bought the acrylic shelf because I wanted it to be like toilet paper and then you have the shelf. I just didn't want to sit this on the back of the toilet. So I put the acrylic shelf and the shelf has holes for you to drill it into the wall, but I didn't want to drill it into the cabinets. I bought this Gorilla Glue. So this is double-sided Gorilla Glue tape. And it's sturdy, okay? I, you ain't getting nothing through here. So you just measure it out on there and then you peel it off and then you stick the other side onto the wall. Similar to the command strips like the Velcro runs or, yeah, so. Yeah, but this double-sided tape is coming in handy. All right, so none of this is in order. I just did, went down my list of things that I purchased and just put them on the list. Next, we have this elderberry, 100% orga organic elderberry. Um, I have like allergies and sinuses and it makes me feel like I'm sick. So what I do is just steep some of these like maybe a tablespoon and steep it and then make a little bit of elderberry tea because they say the elderberry is for your immune system. So I just bought a, a big batch of it so I don't have to worry about um, buying more over and over. And yeah, thoroughly cooked for 15 to 20 minutes prior to consumption as a tea, one to two tablespoons, oh it says one to two tablespoons and eight ounces of water. And then you store it in a, a cool dry place. I also use the emergency, the elderberry emergencies for the vitamins and stuff when I'm feeling like I'm sneezing too much or anything like that. If you want to build your immune system, you gotta get some of these elderberries. Next, we have these under eye patches. I see all the girls with the gold ones. These aren't the ones y'all have. But if you're in the market for if you have puffy eyes like me in the morning because I sleep with the window open because I'm hot. Um, these come in a lot of like liquid and I just kind of dry them off a little bit because they do slide them down my face when I don't and it decrease I don't know if it actually decreases or if it's in my mind that it decreases the puffiness in my face but these come in a pack of 60 pieces in here these are an eye treatment mask and they seem to be working thus far next we have these large shower caddies in a two pack 
I used to have the kind of goes over the shower head, but I opted for these because I wanted my stuff to be on the back of the wall, like not where the shower is. Cause I tend to find that like that thing gets rusted and I don't like that. I'm sure it's in the bathroom anyway, but it's not getting as much water and my products aren't all wet when I'm done. So I bought these shower caddies and I absolutely love them. I have some that's more like a rack. And it looked, but I like that these have that black bar on them. That's what I like the most because it just looks like nice in the, in the shower. Next, we have this 12 pack of clear containers. Um, if you're looking for something really sturdy, this is not it, but they did, they're doing the job for what I need. When I was in my other place, I had a shoe rack and my closet now, I don't want a shoe rack in there. So I have my shoes and boxes and then the ones that, I may have traveled and I had to throw the boxes away. I needed some place to put those. So I put them in these things and I just like it. It's cute, it's organized, and it does the job. Next we have this 24 inch four panel play pen for Charlie. Okay, so if y'all all watch my vlog, y'all saw he was on death road and I had that gate up and I just couldn't deal with that. Because if someone wants to come in, this dog is blocking the door, it was just, stupid so i bought this play pen and charlie loves to play pen sometimes i'm looking for him and he guess where he at in his little play pen well it's just kind of like a little re a oasis for him it doesn't have a top but he loves it and he just be so cute in there <laughs> and, and when i'm getting on his nerves he goes right in there and relax himself um, and if y'all also watch my t haul video, I put the carpet tiles in there. So he got him a little bit of like his room. Next, we have this acrylic cutting board. And it's just a cutting board that's clear that it looks like you cutting on your counter. And that's it. It's nice. I didn't need a new cutting board. I saw the girls on TikTok and might be some YouTubers as well that have this same cutting board. And I said, oh, that's cool. I want one. So I bought this acrylic cutting board. I'm not sure the size. I, everything would be linked down below, but I've already used it and it works like a charm. It has some scratches on it. I don't know if y'all can tell. Probably can't. And I like that one because I don't think I like wood cutting boards. There's something about wood being porous and being a cutting board that don't register in my brain. I don't know. So next we have the spice rack. I opted for the 24 piece. Um, spice rack. I also bought from Amazon the tears to go with them to put them in the drawer and I bought the acrylic ones like the tears are clear and I bought the jars with the bamboo tops and it comes with two stickers one for the top of the jar and one for the bottle of the jar and they're very simple. It comes with the funnel. It was simple to transfer the spices from one jar to the other. Why are we doing this? I don't know. I just love it though. Like it's like, okay, where's the thing? And everything looks the same and I'm not fishing through trying to find the spices when, I cook, when I'm cooking. Okay, next we have these broom holder hooks. Now with these, let's tell the truth. The adhesive on the back of this isn't very good. So it comes with the adhesive and the adhesive still on the wall, but this part isn't. So all I'm gonna do is put some of those Gorilla Glue strips on there and then remount it with that. But it comes with the broom holder piece and then I think a pack of four and it also came with a little hook. So you can hook, most times brooms and mops and things have like a little hole at the top so you can hook it on thing so either you can push the broom through here or you can hook it on the hook okay next we have my new bar stools my other place didn't have bar stools but i bought these ones from amazon in the color i think it's called white multi and i went with these because a lot of the options had a set of two and i needed three because four is too many and what I'm going to do with the other chair. So I kept, I put in the surge bar, a three pack, like a three piece bar stool set. These are the ones I purchased. They are comfortable. I'm sitting in one right now. They're pretty comfortable, easy to put together. They do the job, they spin and it's not like sitting on, I wanted to get something that had a back as well. And I still need to scotch guard them. I've had my nieces over here and one of them got a little bit of ketchup on my chair. And just with some Folex, it came right out. But I need to scotch guard them. But for the most part, 
so far so good. I'm, I'm wearing jeans in them. I eat here um, if I'm not being lazy and sitting on the couch. <laughs> but yeah, they're pretty, they're pretty nice. They're sturdy. And if you're in the market for new stools, try these. They also come in a full faux leather, but I opted for the fabric ones. All right, next we have this Carol pot set. And I opted, and I bought the 11 piece one, which comes with like three pots, three skillets, lids, and I think it came with two utensils. And I love it. I um, had like some, I still have my stainless steel set, but a lot of times with the stainless steel, it sticks. And I just needed something that was non-stick again because when you first learn to cook, you need that non-stick. And cleaning that and cleaning the ones that stainless, I don't have time for that. So these are very easy to clean. It's pretty much the stuff just, you can just wipe it out. And I like them. They have a full wood handles on them and they're just nice. It just looks like a very expensive pot set and I think it was under $200. It was only $99 for the 11 piece. And this is a good little set, if I do say so myself. Next, we have this roll-up dish rack. And this is one of my favorite buys of them all. Because when you just have like a few little items that you don't need to put a full set of dishes in the dishwasher, and you can just let them dry and it looks so cute on your counter when everything is nice and neat and... I just love this little thing. It ain't nothing as simple, but it's the little things that matter. I don't know what size I bought. I'm going to put it when I link it, but whatever this size is, <laughs> is the one I needed. And it fits on my sink perfectly. Did the same, for the girls with the DJI Pocket 3, you all will know that when you turn your camera off, that lens part will swivel and it'll be exposed and you'd be scared that you didn't scratch your lens. So I bought this silicone case and you just, I'm going to show y'all in a split screen, and you just wrap it around your camera. This part protects it when you're traveling or if you just need to bring your camera with you or, and you're not using it. Um, and I bought this little silicone little thing to put over so we aren't damaging our lens because this camera is a really nice camera and we don't want to be messing it up. And it also covers the um, screen, I think. Do it cover the screen? I want to say this part covers the screen, but I can't remember. I'm going to show y'all when I put it on there. All right, this next item is for the readers. Now, I'm an audiobook girl, but when I do find a page turner, I will read. And this is a nightlight for your books. Can y'all turn it on? Can y'all see? And I bought my book. This is one of my favorite books, When God Winks at You. So all you do is hook it on to the book. You don't necessarily have to hook it on the page that you are reading. I don't hook it on the page that I'm reading. But you hook it on and then it gives it this tilt. And then you can turn this. So if you want, like if it's dark and you want one page, you can tilt it this way or tilt it the other way. And this is a really good buy. And it's for the people that read at night and you know how you fall asleep and you don't want to get back up. That's why I bought this. Because it had to be something invented for me to not be able to turn that big light off <laughs> or to turn the lamp off when I fall asleep reading. Okay, last but not least, I have a air purifier. I'm not really certain if air purifiers work. Do humidifiers really work? I don't really be knowing because I don't really feel super different when I have them. But I bought one because I have allergies and sinus issues and asthma. So I wanted to purify my air. So I keep this one in my bedroom. It's black. It also comes in white and... For the most part, I turn it on. It turns off by itself. So I try to like do it at night is when I n normally keep it on and purify my air so I can have clean air to breathe. <laughs> I don't like that. That completes this Amazon haul. I know a lot of things you already saw, but I hope that I gave you some uh, ideas on other things that you possibly can buy from Amazon. And... 
Everything will be linked down below. Please like, comment, subscribe, and until the next video, keep it cute.